Uh, perfect timing. My thingy. Alrighty. Wish me luck. Two minutes. Hello and welcome back, everybody. Hello. Nice to have you all. Back at the Kaiser races today. Yeah. Today is my level again. Um, not well, what much. We, what, we, uh, what should we be expecting here with the title like black and white? This is a very easy level. Um, I tried to keep it simple. Uh, there's no weapons. Uh, I only black and white colors. Um, I, I expect it will be uh, it will be completed very quickly by pretty much everyone. So the challenge has been issued by the level creator. No more than fifteen minutes. The level is. Uploaded. I just need to share the ID with everyone. Okay, and where's my Discord? Share the ID. Alright. And the countdown will begin. Who wants to start fastest? All right, let's go take a look at what is happening on stream. We yeah. have Game, Game Master, Master Game Man, Fox. Game Fox, Ozuma, and CC the Owl. Some good racers. Um, Ozuma might really excel in this level. Uh, he is really good at just like the simple platforming stuff. Um, he actually makes Kaizos in um, in the like. ROM hacks. So, you know, where platforming and and uh, getting from point A to B is is all that the, the ROM hacks are about. So Zoma's got a real big advantage there. Good good, uh, good to see. Uh, looking forward to it after last week. Uh, a little bit of trouble on Little Max level. Yeah, that's the thing about ROM hacks. You don't have the, uh, the option to... Uh, have extra features with your weapons. Charge kick is just charge kick, right? For now. All right, so we begin. Game Masterman, almost at uh, the second screen. That doesn't look too uh, like anything too much. A couple of jumps here and there. I mean, uh... no, it's very simple, uh, very straightforward. You know. CC's 20 seconds in and already at the second checkpoint, so... Or first checkpoint, rather. Nice. Very fast, very clean level. Um, and like I said, I expected just a few minutes across the board from everyone. Um, Again, okay. Fox has made it to that checkpoint. CC doing the spike fall. Pausing on, on the pause spike guys. fall. That's exactly what you want to see. And there we go. The next checkpoint as well. CC might uh, wrap this level up in two minutes here. Very short level. Actually, the playtester of, of this level uh, asked me if I want to make it a little bit harder just because uh, it it's too easy. And uh, I know it's really easy. But I wanted to keep it easy just for uh, for the sake of, of racers. I wanted something that any beginner racer could pick up and still be proud that they beat. You should have told me before I signed up for commentary. <laughs> well, you can always play it afterwards. Absolutely. You might think that would improve the, the success rate of completion, but nope. I'm half expecting somebody to post a, a 
picture of the star uh, any minute now. You know, it's it's been almost two minutes. Our Seems like everybody behind the scenes. Yeah, there are a bunch more racers behind the scenes. You are right. And you said Ozuma should have this uh, in the bag, but having a difficult time on this first screen here. A little bit. Just a neutral jump when the UFOs in the right position. CC's in the final call. section here. Good old Roku blocks. Taking a moment to study the pattern. Game Master Man found the secret <laughs> JDE room. CC gets it. CC's about to clean this level up. There's a, there's a point on the that Roku block section where he almost jumped a little too early and had enough time to save himself. Yeah, there's plenty of time there. Um, it's like I said, it's it's a pretty easy uh, level all across the board, so I, I expect quick finishes from just about everyone. Game Master Man moving on as well. All these one tiles with spikes on either side of you, enough to... Give me goosebumps. Position yourself uh, correctly in the jumps. CC the Owl and Fatty are both done off screen. So yes. uh, there CC we go. Showing us that finish here. They are really quick work. Three minutes, 10 seconds on his in-game timer. Yeah, very simple level here. Game Fox also on the last section. Game Master Man on the last section. Pumba finished the uh, the level off screen as well. I mean, I think you cursed Ozoma. Marino also finished this the uh, the level off screen as well. Jeez, a Marino. Team Masterman on the boss fight. I'm in a little bit of trouble. So with the boss fight, there's only one position where you can crush the boss. So uh, if you use too many of those... Uh... Of those elevator blocks, you do make the fight more difficult for yourself. Overall, it's still a really easy fight, but uh, Game Master Man needs to uh, restart there. Needs to reposition the boss before he sends those platforms up. Ozoma on the next section. It looks like Dirksy's on the final section before the boss. Oh, Game Master Man almost getting it. Ooh, so close. Zoma's on the spike fall. Making quick work of this level. Ooh, Game Fox got squished by doing the early Yoku jump. Game Master Man squishing him on the bottom. Nicely done. So we still got a few racers off screen here. Dr. Lumen just finished the level off screen. Um, let's see. It looks like we still have Rad Robot. 
Little Mac finished off just now. Yeah, he, you know, Bonzibur can't get him in quick enough. Little Mac is uh, finishing too quick. Like I said, I, I was expecting uh, between 5 and 15 minutes from every player here, so uh, looks like I was about right. Most players here are done at the 7 minute mark. Hey CC, welcome. What'd you think of, of uh, the level? There's Little Mac. Uh, he, Little Mac is done now. He just finished as well. Um, I think Rad Robot is the only other person who has a stream who is uh, still racing. Hey, definitely weren't joking around when he said it was going to be a quick one. Yeah, that that's what uh, what I was trying to aim for. Something fast and easy. And I made sure the whole level can be can be beat without uh, without dying. So you don't need to die at a checkpoint or anything. You can just just beat the level in one go. I see, she's saying uh, he, he thinks he would have uh, been a little better if it was three times longer. I hear you, CC. And Skypilot asked me if I wanted to make it longer, but uh, it's one of the things I didn't want to do. Zoma has found the special JDE Easter egg room. Dirksy's about to finish off this section here. Looks like Rad Robot's camera froze there. But he's in the last section as well. This is a really cool screen uh, when the the, rate, the runner has the timing figured out with the, the following UFO platforms. Yeah, the UFO jumps are very satisfying to do. Definitely not easy. I love how... Uh... Fatty finished the level first. Um, Fatty is an amazing uh, Mega Man player. He's not actually a Kaizo player. So I, I kind of had to twist his leg here to join today. I, I told him the level was uh, borderline not Kaizo. So, uh, you know, he joined and he cleaned up house. I, I expected uh, either him or Kumba to, uh, to win. And yeah, Fatty uh, ended up winning. Oh, it's good to see some new faces here. Zoma here in the final section as well. Dirksy's has killed the time, man. Nicely done. King Fox right behind him. Can he get it done first try? No. Like Rad Robot's at the Yoku Block section, giving it a study before he jumps. Oh, that was almost it for Game Fox, but uh, time. Oh, so close. He's a bit of a troll. Rad Robot's going to the boss now. I don't know if Rad Robot's ever done any UFO jumps before, so this might be a learning experience for him. Live on Speed Game. You'd love to see it. it. Looks like he's got the hang of it pretty quickly. Just has to figure out the timing. Game Fox at another boss attempt. trying to squish him squishing works going, going down oh 
Oh, does he got it? Oh, so close. Alright, Rad Robot, time to fight Time Man. Squished him immediately. First attempt. Sniping out Game Fox, but gets it right after. Doesn't get and much there closer he is. than that. Zoma's the last racer in the final section of the level. He has a little bit of trouble with these elevator uh, laser jumps. Yeah, you definitely uh, sent him a little commentator's curse at the start of the stream. I think so. He knows what he needs to do, but uh, these these jumps, although they're not too difficult, they are kind of scary. Uh, you don't want to jump off the, off the uh, elevator because you feel like you're not going to be able to make it on the other side. Yeah, but this is uh, a Mega Man Maker Kaizo. Are we going to be back here at uh, 4 p.m. Eastern again? Uh, yeah, it'll be f this time uh, going forward, at least until Daylight Saving Time again. Um, so we, we always play at 20 o'clock UTC, which is uh, 4, 4 p.m. Eastern currently. Gotcha. And of course, uh, every about about every year, sometimes twice a year, there's always talk in Washington, D.C. about getting rid of Daylight Savings Time. That'd be nice. I, I hate Daylight Saving Time. <laughs> but that's not enough Mega Man Maker for Game Fox. He's, uh, he's loading up something else here. So, like this is kind of tradition for Game Fox. Every time a race is done, he goes into the editor and he looks at how the level was made and he kind of deconstructs it over on his own stream. So, uh, if you want to see the Dr. Fox analysis, as we call it, uh, you can head over to Game Fox's stream and take a look at what he's doing. He can even deconstruct it in German. He can. Really exciting to have such a uh, diverse group of runners. Ozoma uh, streamed all the way from uh, Japan. No, Ozoma is a uh, German as well, actually. Oh, um, who's the Oka. Japanese? Oka. Oka is oh. the Japanese uh, racer. I got confused by the letter O. It's very rare for Oka to actually join us on the races. Uh, in, in Japan, the races yeah. happen something at like 5 o'clock in the morning, so um, he doesn't often uh, join in them. V very understandable. It's always fun to, to launch yourself into spikes over and over again. Maybe exactly. not at 5 a.m. That was a fast race. That was a very fast race, Bonza. You are correct. Like I mentioned yesterday over on my stream, uh, I planned for a race that was going to be easy enough for uh, for anybody, even beginners, to pick up for the first time and feel proud that they beat it. That was my goal. Well, next time, give me a heads up, uh, and I might just join one of those races. Sounds good. I expect you to beat this off stream. <laughs> and uh, post a star over in the Discord that, that proves you uh, beat the level as well. Ah, oh, damn homework. Yep, your homework has been assigned. It needs to be done now. One at Tile Fall. So tricky. 
You can actually pause uh, to get a, a better placement next to the spike wall. It's really up to the player what they feel comfortable with. Or what strats uh, uh, fit into their their theory of uh, pride. Exactly. Um, Bonsai says it's fine to end. I say we give it another minute. Um, we'll wait until uh, Ozoma's at the 15 minute mark on his uh, clock time. And then we can probably uh, call it. Yeah, sounds good to me. Make sure everyone uh, goes and gives these racers a follow. Uh, maybe even a subscription if you're feeling saucy. Uh, without them racing the races, we wouldn't have the races to watch being raced. Absolutely. Normally the races are a little bit longer than this. Uh, this is one of the shorter races we've uh, probably ever had. But, uh, you know, not everything needs to be long. Yeah, it's good to shift it up a little bit. The door troll made you lose six minutes. All right, Ozoma on the Yokus. Is he going to do it this time? Taking a moment to study up. That jump was almost too late. Beautiful. Okay, Azoma at the boss section. At this point, let's just uh, watch him beat the boss. There's no point in uh, ending early. I concur. You didn't get back fast enough? That's alright, Fox. You can try this level again for a no-death run. <laughs> Good luck with that one. So if you beat this level with no deaths, uh, the level actually ends up becoming like 40 seconds long. It's really short and sweet. Oh, very nice. Beautiful. A little too hasty. Run out of platforms. He, yeah, I think he was just trying to feel the water, not sure what he needed to do. Oh, and he's got this, though. Row. Yeah, very nice. Oh, that was a new strategy. Unfortunately, double Oh, KO. no. That last UFO jump looks so tight. And an immediate death. E.G. Zozoma. Beautiful. And everyone has finished the level. 100% completion, under 20 minutes in game time. You'll love to see it. We will be back again next week with another uh, Kaiser race. It will be most likely longer than this level and harder than this level. Um, so there'll be a little bit, a little bit more competition between the racers. But I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Yeah, I hope anyone who's been uh, curious about these uh, has maybe gotten a little uh, gusto to, to launch this one up definitely doesn't look too challenging i know i'm gonna i'll, I'll get my homework done before the weekend I'll, i can i can promise you that hope so i'm keeping it to it all right all right take care everyone have a good weekend <laughs>